How is it going, everyone? Dry FIFA here, and welcome back to episode number five of my Manchester United Mode on FIFA 17. So, guys, as you can see, we're of course in our training and uh, double D's, man, G's, and C's as well. So, Pogba's the only one doing so well in that session. Um, let's go ahead actually and check out our inbox, see if I got anything back from Bayern Munich. And yeah, so. Review the offer, you have made for Andrew Sanchez, and we can't accept. Uh, and I think it's because he just moved there, they're probably not going to um, let us buy him. But let me go in and see if I can put a sneaky, uh, not a sneaky, a cheeky, there we go, a cheeky bid in and see if we can raise it up a little bit. So we offer 15, we're going to go ahead and go. Um, I don't want to overdo it, so I'm going to go with 20 and see if I can get them started. I don't think they're going to go for it, which is why I'm going a little bit lower. But Renzo Sanchez is a player that Manchester United was in, uh, interested in. In fact, um, it was actually actually said, oh, Rooney's going to be off for nine days. Damn. It was actually said that he was uh, pretty much, he chose to go to Bayern Munich because of the fact that it took so long to, uh, well, we took so long to, of course, Manchester United to announce uh, Jose Marino. So he wasn't sure who was going to be, of course, the manager of Manchester United, which was stated from, of course, uh, Bayern Munich uh, football people themselves. So um and there they go again they of course denied so they're definitely not going to sell a man so that sucks all right so let's go ahead and see we can definitely test the resolve i think they might go for it let's see if they grab it in fact uh i think i'm gonna go with 50 since it's a bit closer to the 63.8 that they're asking for and i think they might just bite on to it so let's see hopefully do if not man all right guys so we're going to be facing off of course against southampton at old trafford on our own turf which means we cannot afford to drop any points here southampton are a team that can definitely cause you some problems on their day uh the good thing is we are at home so we should definitely make sure everyone fears coming to of course the theater of dreams we need to make sure people understand that when you come here only defeats awaits right so we're going to go with the 4411 formation uh, fielding, of course, the strongest thing we can with Imbridge up front, Wamata in behind, Martial, and of course, uh, Rashford on the wings with Pogba and Fellaini in midfield. So, a, a really good mixture there. A lot of pace, and of course, some players that can definitely stand in midfield and, um, you know, give us, of course, the defending that we need. Uh, with Pogba pushing forward a bit to get in, involved, of course. Um, to be honest, Wamata been playing very well in the number 10 role. Pogba did very good there too, as well. So, I'm uh, looking for him to do so uh, for us. Uh, let's see what Southampton's going. We're probably going to be going to 4 3 3 formation or a 4 2 3 1 formation. And it looked like a 4 3 3 formation or a 4 1 2 1 2 formation, if you want to put it that way. But uh, I would say more of a 4 3 3 formation. So interesting one there. All right, come on, guys. Let's defend this one. Don't concede any goals. There we go. All right, let's get it out. Come on, come on. Close them down. There we go. All right, let's see if we can go on a quick counter there. Oh, Rashford couldn't get past him. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Man, I thought I was going to sneak into that top corner there. Good one there. I wonder how close was it. Uh, not that close. Oh, come on, close him down. Ah, uh, nice one back there from Rashford. All right, come on, let's hold the ball up a little bit here. Nice. All right, push forward. Marshall. I see you go near post. Oh, did the keeper. I don't know if the keeper got to touch that one or not. Couldn't tell. Probably went over. Let's see again from the replay here. Oh, it went over actually. Not the greatest, but uh, pretty close. Decent for Marshall. Ah, come on. There we go. Nice and fell into there. Nice. All right. Let's play through. Nice. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, good defending there. Very good defending. There we go. Right. Nice. Ah, couldn't get a hit there. He's trying to go for the shot, but they, they stopped me pretty well. Turn. Nice from Shaw there. Really nice turn there from Shaw. All right, so we can take it to the byline and cross this one in. Oh. Out wide. There we go. All right, Valencia. Nice. One time. Oh, what a save. What an absolutely cracking save. Fantastic. Martial again. Definitely working to keep it this time. Very good. Very, very good. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. We're flowing pretty well. Nice. Come on. Oh. There we go. All right, let's push forward. Out wide. 
Uh, everybody seems so slow to push forward, man. I think we need to get some pace here, players cross it in. There we go. All right, cut it back. Ah, ref. Got to be a foul. Got to be a foul. There we go. Pick up penalty. What was he thinking there, man? What was he thinking? Yeah, that was definitely a foul. Pretty good. I like I like uh, the ammunition there too as well. Fun. Come on, bro. You can't be tackling like that, man, in the box. You know it's going to be only one thing. <laughs> It's only going to be one thing. They bring on Cedric. And he's a good defender. Um, he plays right back, right? I think, in my opinion. I really hate this penalty thing, man. Oh, my God. <laughs> that is so awful. Absolutely awful. I don't like this penalty system right now. It's, it's trash. All right, guys, so we're bringing on Michael Carrick, Mkhitaryan, and, of course, <sighs> Memphis Depay, as much as it pains me to say it, he's just not clicking. I'm not quite sure what's going on at the moment. Hopefully, he can definitely start stepping it up. Um, but I had to make the changes. The players are just not 100% fit, and uh, we needed some fresh legs in to see if we can. Uh, they, they'll be working us, that's for sure, Southampton. So we want to try and see if we can uh, influence the game a bit with some fresh pace, some fresh legs. And see what happens. So, all right, let's see if we can try. Ah, come on. They are closing us down so well. There we go. All right. Ooh, turn. Ah, look at that. Completely close us down, man. They're doing so well. All right, nice. Man, damn. And there he goes, guys. It's a draw. We couldn't muster anything, which is not good at all. The one result we were fearing to have, and it happened. Right, guys. So, as you can see, six shots for us three in target, 62% of the ball in position. That is absolutely crazy. Two shots for them, nothing on target. They didn't offer much but just sitting there, man. It's, it's crazy. Um, pretty close in pass accuracy as you can see there 50% shot accuracy Absolutely ridiculous in my opinion Anton Valencia played well uh, You know decent uh, stats there, but man, it was just frustrating. It just closes down so well It was just so hard to get anything going All right, so let's see eight mil from Offenheim um, We're not looking to sell him at the moment, but I think I'm gonna go just reject offer You never know when to keep options open at the moment, ah, it's another one. Are you kidding me? Crystal Palace, definitely not in our own league. <laughs> Just not going to happen, man. It's a bit higher, though, than Offenheim, so can't complain they were with them, but not going to sell to any of our any teams in the Premier League. I'd rather send them overseas, even if I had to send them on a loan and then sell them after. <laughs> you know, if I was going to do that, definitely don't want to threaten anybody else, man. All right. Let's see. Oh my god, they finally came back with James Rodriguez and they're talking about 97 mil. <laughs> 97 mil, guys. Um, yeah, <laughs> that's like spending pretty much almost the entirety of our, of course, what we have for our budget, which is just not going to happen. Um, I think I'm gonna go to 60 and just leave it at that. <laughs> if they take it, they take it. If they don't, oh well. Not happening. All right, guys. So we're gonna be facing, of course, against Notts County in, of course, the League Cup. And uh, this should be a very, very interesting one. Nevertheless, we've never played this team before, so I'm not quite sure what to expect. Um, but it's gonna be an interesting one, nevertheless, because. We were expecting to win the game, then we played against uh, Southampton, and that didn't happen. So, we'll see. And of course, you guys know we're going to be sticking, of course, with the same formation, the 4 4 1 1 formation. It's a formation that works very best for us. I'm not quite sure what happened in the last episode, but nevertheless, Rooney's back in, as you can see, Ibrovic. And of course, we have Mikatarian in uh, with the pie, of course, on the wings. So, changing up a bit. So, we'll see uh, if these changes can definitely give us some impact, hopefully. Uh, resting some players as well. Um, I'm looking forward to this game. I'm really looking forward to the game. See if we can get back to winning ways, so to speak. So um, let's see what Nats Count is going with. Um, probably going to be the same formation. Probably a 4 4 2 formation, if I'm not surprised. Oh, 4 1 4 1 formation. So they're packing that midfield. Uh, one to definitely close us down. 
and they're probably going to play some long balls and probably try to hit us in the counter as well. Uh, very, very, very clever of them, to be honest. All right, come on, guys. Nice. Ooh, nice one, too, there. All right, there we go. Watch the run. Ah, look at Pogba. All right, Pogba one time. Oh, what a save. <laughs> what a save. That was a cracking save, man. Fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Right, come on, run. What? Oh, there we go. Ah, uh, what a through pass there. All right, cut it back. All right, go for it. Oh, what a save. All right, come on, Rooney. Let's put it back in the box. Ah, look nice. Oh, just bend away. That would have been a spectacular goal like that went in. Man, they're closing us down well. I think they're trying to go for the draw, especially since it's so late. <laughs> but we want to we want to win, man. I think we can go past him here. Ah, nice. All right, look at the run. Look at the run. There we go. All right. I right, cut it back. Ah, look at the run. There we go. Nice. All right. Uh, in the box. Yes. <laughs> yes. In the dying minutes of the game. Absolutely fantastic. And it's Rashford. The man that got subbed in is doing his job. Absolutely fantastic from him. Look at him just wait in the box. I mean, that is just absolutely fantastic. The young lad comes in and absolutely saved the day. <laughs> this is great. That has to be the, the final goal in extra time, man. That is fantastic. Marcus Rashford. What can I say? Absolutely fantastic from him. <laughs> I'm still buzzing, man. I'm still buzzing right now. I just can't believe it. This should be the end of it. Come on. Kick the ball off. I know it's going to be the end. All right. Come on. Where's the whistle? And there we go. And <laughs> the whistle goes. Absolutely fantastic. Man. Look at the fans. Coach is there applauding, of course, the fans. The players know how important this win was. And, man, two young lads combining together to uh, give us the win, save us the embarrassment. That would have been if we hadn't scored. Look at that one shot, one goal. Comes in and show his worth as a young player. Absolutely fantastic from Rashford. And we move on, guys. <laughs> we move past Nats County. Um, shocking. I mean, they did very well. All, it was really us the whole game. Uh, but man, what a fantastic performance. All right, guys. So as you can see, they have one shot, nothing on target. Five shots, four on target for us. 59% of possession. And you can see 88 to their 82% pass accuracy. 80% shot accuracy. I mean, it's a fantastic game. We completely dominated this one. And you can see their Chris Smalling uh, picking up one of the match. I mean, I don't know what else to say. This game was absolutely fantastic. And I'm just so happy that we saved it and scored a goal. Marcus Rashford. All right, guys, so I'm going to leave it off here. As you can see, we have a huge game coming up next, which is going to be, of course, away to Hull City. And <laughs> if you know anything about these games so far, from FIFA 16 to FIFA 17 so far, it just seems like away games are just really difficult, which makes it a bit realistic because in real life, those teams are going to give you a hard time when they come home. It's their, you know, it's their safe haven. They're going to try and put it to you. So uh, expect to be an interesting one. Nevertheless, let me know your thoughts and opinion. Thank you for watching. And of course, guys, as always, I'm your host, Jared FIFA. Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next one. Peace.